A fire pit ignites controversy in Prairie Village. Neighbors wanted to spruce up an unattractive island, but the city says bring it down. KMBC 9's Brian Johnson is live with more. Yeah, well, who doesn't love a good fire, especially at a nice fire pit? There's plenty of room here. You can see for the neighbors to come and gather, have a good time together. But the city says not so. They do not want people coming across these streets and gathering here. They say that is a safety concern. We thought it would just be a simple process, and we were, we were mistaken. Brian Staus owns a landscaping so. business. And so when he was approached by a couple of leaders from the Homeowners Association with the idea of the fire pit, he went to work. I honestly was just so excited to get something done with that island. I assumed with the Homes Association approaching me that it was it was the homeowner's uh, property and it was a homeowner's responsibility to take care of it. He had no idea the city owned the land. The fire pit now sits half finished compared to his original drawings. His company donated the time, but the cost of materials is $2,500. It was all about community. And just bringing our neighbors together, and our neighbors love the idea. And it's just like the island up the street with the fountain. It's a gathering point. The city says it should not be a gathering point. The city council also has issues with the process, but most of all, concerns about safety. People around the fire pit, kids run around the neighborhood. In that environment, I don't think a fire pit in the middle of, of a public street is, is the right kind of environment for that sort of a thing. The fire marshal has no problems with fire pits. The fire marshal said there was nothing illegal about taking our own fire pits over there. So uh, I think that's probably going to be what we do. And we reached out to all of the city council members here. None of them agreed to do an on camera interview. As for the fire pit, Stout says this will not become an urban ruin in the middle of the city. He's already working on plans to convert the fire pit into a tabletop, perhaps, maybe a flowering pot, or if need be, they will remove all of this and restore it back to the grass and dirt. Reporting live in Prairie Village, Brian Johnson, KMBC 9 News. And the city's public works director needs to meet with the builder and the homeowners association before taking any plans to the city council. It could be weeks or months before the issue is finally resolved.